Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Chrisanne and today we're gonna be reacting to <laughs> 17, Hitori Janai. So this is their third Japanese single and it just literally just came out but I did a live so um, this is me reacting to it today and I'm super super excited because you know I have fully indebted myself. No, no, I have fully committed to becoming a baby carrot so I'm new to this. And I've loved all their Japanese comebacks, so I really hope that this turns out so well, which I, I know and I'm confident it will because woozy, but I can't wait. So let's just watch this because I'm super, super excited and I have nothing else to say. I can say everything after, so just go. No oh, Hoshi. Oh, why does he have an earpod? Yeah. Janai means you're not alone and I really like okay the song the song is very good it's very it's more of a very feel-good song so I've already heard it on TikTok because I did the challenge and everything the song Hitori Janai is just more of like a comforting song where, where they're saying like you're not alone you know we're here um, like the world is in chaos right now but like we're still here we're still here for you and all that and it's very, just very comforting to see, you know, to see that and to hear the song because 
it's such a feel good song and it I think it's really meant to uplift you and that's generally how the song is and how I feel. I love everything about it. I'm very surprised with um Myungho's Myungho Mingho Ah the Eat the Eat's uh, voice. It's like it's so effortless when he does high notes now. Also Hoshi's voice as well. Woozy, I'm surprised he didn't have much parts, but I know that but even with his part, like I could like figure out with his voice. But it was really really good. It was it was really next um dance. There isn't much of a dance, there's a small dance part, but I have seen the dance. Um it's very easy easy in the sense of what they did on TikTok so um, I'm sure there's gonna be a little bit more complicated stuff but when they put out like a performance video but that's 17 they'll definitely do something but it's a little bit more relaxed for sure because it's more of a feel-good song next the production oh gosh the production is so good because uh, what they did is like pandemic right like you guys are connecting over the internet, video calls, pictures, and all that. And I was so surprised with their choice in colors because I thought they would go with something more gentle, I guess, more neutral, more of like the saturated, neutral, very Japanese um, drama, uh, drama esque, you know, feel good summer style. But they went with colorful and I think it really fit the theme but I was just very surprised but it really really fit the theme so well because um, it's all about like being alive and having fun and you know being comfort being comfort to someone so I really like how they use the colors and it's so cute like I love Mingyu scene oh my god don't get that <laughs> I like when I saw Mingyu like I really felt like my heart kind of like warmed up and broke at the same time because I'm totally like, a completely baby carrot guys like I just became a carrot December of 2020 like literally I'm so new to this so the first thing I had to encounter was Mingyu scandal and you know for me I was like, oh dear god, like, I hope it won't be like a one whole monster X thing because that would break my heart. Because, like, I, the Woozy is my favorite, like, I'm attached to all of them. And, like, the fact that they're gonna separate the 13, like, that, that never crossed my mind because they were like, they're like brothers, literally. So it's like, what? But after everything happened and, you know, it's peace now in Carrotland, like, I'm just so happy that. He's back, and when I saw his scenes, like with the clothes, I was like, "Oh God, that's so Mingyu," you know. <laughs> Each of the boys' scenes really fit them well. It fit their personalities well. Yeah, it was it was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun to see those scenarios in the music video. Of course, I love the the special effects because you can see like when they did the party poppers, like everything popped out. Like it's it's almost like it's 3D. So they really skewed the perception, like um instead of you just watching a scene they're like they're like going in and outdoors you know like twisting it around so it like it really catches your attention so i really love the production styling okay in terms of styling there was a lot of very casual choices but what i do like about it is that it's very much following the personal style of the boys because the boys they all have their own personal style i did a tiktok video on this you like I'll, I'll upload the vlog on it but um, each of them have their own style even if though even if they look very very similar even the way the stylist styles them they do have their own specific style so I like how that was brought out here in the music video and I also like how they made use of the pop of color with all the scenes and yeah the stylist of 17 always makes good choices so I, I do not doubt her, him, they, them. So in terms of visuals, obviously, I am going to be drawn to Uzi. Like even in the group thing, like I was drawn to Uzi. But when I speak of visuals now, it's more of who caught my attention first. So the one who caught my atten attention most here was Escoops and Jongan, for sure. And 
surprisingly, surprisingly, Dino, like Dino, I don't know. He just he like he grew up and he really caught my attention. Like, obviously, Jongan caught it, my attention, and then S Coops, and then Dino. Dino's scene was very short, but like my attention was all on him. In the end, this is such a good, good and perfect comeback for them after everything that's happened. Like carrots are just so relieved and so happy that you know the boys stay together and they can continue to promote normally and like go is back you know it's like everything just went back and it's like such a big 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 relief and i'm just so happy for it and yeah that's all i can say i'd love to know what you guys thought about it please comment in the comment section down below are you a carrot are you a baby carrot i would love to know who is your bias as well please don't forget to give this a thumbs up Subscribe because I click the notification for updates and I will see you guys next time.